Number one, in terms of health care, I have some very good news. And the good news is that you don't need any more money to provide comprehensive, quality health care to every man, woman, and child in this country because we're already spending much more than we have to spend. We don't need more money, but what do we need? We need political courage to take on the insurance companies and the drug companies and the doctors and to come together and finally establish a single-payer national health care system guaranteeing health care to all people. So in other words, on that issue, there is good news. It does take money to rebuild the infrastructure. But in the area of health care, please understand, we are spending 40% more per capita than the Canadians, double what many European countries are spending on health care, and so many of our people don't have any insurance at all. So what we need there is not, as some have suggested, including people in the Clinton administration, we don't need tens of billions of dollars more. You don't need to raise taxes on workers' health insurance benefits in order to pay for national health care. We could do it now if we have the guts to do it. Let's do it.